This research trial is comparing the performance of historical feed barley varieties with new feed barley genetics. Now growers are always looking for new varieties that will have improved yield and agronomic characteristics. Now why should a grower consider new feed barley varieties? There's exciting new Canadian, European and American feed barley varieties coming to the market. We do encourage growers to talk to their local seed growers about which varieties are showing really great local adaptability. Um, and then, you know, CDC Austinson has really been a great historical variety, but there's some new options coming that I think can make some great improvements on grower operations. We have new to Canada European feed barley varieties like ESMA, KWS Kelly and RGT Planet. ESMA Secan is the Canadian agent. It was bred in Germany. It's a two row variety. Then we have KWS Kelly. Secan is the Canadian agent. It was bred in Germany, a two row variety. And RGT Planet. Uh, again, Secan is the Canadian agent. It was bred in France by RAGT. It's grown globally in Europe, New Zealand, and South Africa. Secan's not entirely sure what the market for this variety will be, either feed or malt, but it certainly will be a feed option for growers. And this variety may need fungicide application due to it not having strong net blotch resistance. Now, these new European varieties have have excellent standability and really represent uh, a new option for Canadian growers of feed barley. We have new feed barley varieties from US breeding programs. There's four new lines from Michael McKay's barley breeding program of Highland Seeds in Moses Lake, Washington. The Highland Barley Breeding Program grew out of the West Bet Bread Breeding Program. Now, this was a breeding program that released popular varieties like Xena, which in its prime was grown on 1.7 million acres in Alberta, and the newer variety Oriana. AB Hag from FP Genetics was bred at the Field Crop Development Center of Olds College. It has excellent forage quality, standability equal to the strongest checks, and incredible drought tolerance as demonstrated in 2018. AB Hag is a homegrown solution to Alberta's tough growing conditions. AB Wrangler from Cantera also bred at the Field Crop Development Center, a two-row feed barley with moderate resistance rating for Fusarium head blight. AB Cadillac from Alliance Seed, bred at the Field Crop Development Center. This is a six row feed barley variety with moderate resistance to spot form net blotch and spot blotch. AB Toefield Seacan, bred at the Field Crop Development Center. It is a new six row feed variety. We have this all compared to historical feed varieties like CDC Austinson. CDC Austinson was registered with CFIA in 2009. It represents a barley variety that's been grown on the prairies for over a decade. CDC Austinson is the most commonly grown feed barley variety in Alberta, representing 18% of the seeded barley acres in 2020.